Okay, boys and girls, we are at the Governor's Mansion. This first house we passed is a little guest house that the Governor's Mansion has. And the Governor and the First Lady do actually live here. They live upstairs. Uh, that's their private residence. And the downstairs, most of it is open for tours on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Um, so obviously we can't go inside today and we don't have time for that anyway. But uh, if you ever come back to Montgomery, y'all um, are welcomed by the Governor and the First Lady to take a tour of it. And uh, it was built, this house was built in 1907. So it's over 100 years old, and it was originally built by General and Mrs. Ligon, and it was uh, sold to the state for $100,000 in the 1950s, and then another $100,000 was spent trying to fix it up. Um, and the governors of Alabama have lived here ever since. Wow. Any questions? Yes. Do all the governors live there? Yes. When it's, when it's their turn, when they are in the term of governorship, when they are the governor, then that's where they live. So when, he, when Governor Riley's not the governor anymore, he'll go back to his house in, uh, I think it's in Ashland. Oh, man, right. Okay. Uh, yes. Yeah. You know what? No one has ever asked me. I don't know. That's a good question. The lieutenant governor. Does anybody know where the lieutenant governor lives? I would imagine he probably has his own house somewhere nearby. Who is that? Jim Folsom Jr. is the lieutenant governor. Yes. Are we about to what? No, we're not getting out of the bus. If you want to pick.